Don't worry about it. Okay. Listen, we know that you have been waiting for a Stella Maggie mashup, and it's finally happening. It's finally happening. And we the truth is, together. nobody knows that how much we love each other. So we're gonna share this with you, but technically, we're sharing it with each other. Yeah. Because it's so exciting. We really love each other. It's true. Nobody knows how much. So, but we can cut through. Like, we can do this I right know, now. I know. Okay. So, I'm going to interview you. Okay, okay. Okay. Do you want to start with the first question? Can I alter the questions? I believe you can. I believe that this is our show. And okay. uh, we make the rules. So PG? Did, did PG anyone? We must stick PG. PG? PG and E? Yes, girl. You PG. are illuminant. PG. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Rock, paper, scissors. Okay. So rock on, on three. Okay, okay. Your hair looks so good. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, ready. Oh! Did Girl? you see it? Okay. Yes, I did. Yes! Okay, okay, she gets it. She gets it. So, how do you keep yourself centered when you have a demanding work schedule? Oh, that's a good one. I work out a lot. Yeah. It's, she's but like, she's she, solid. Yeah. I, like, most people don't know how much I work out. Mm -hmm. And I would be... I have been known to go into the gym and do five hours. Girl. It's bad. Jeez. It's bad because I played basketball my entire life. So playing sports has always been an activity of mine. So now when I go to the gym and I have a day off, yeah. I put a movie on. But if you put a movie on, you got two and a half hours. Yeah. And I won't get off until the movie's done. Certainly not on a cliffhanger or anything like that. So, so anyways, I so just... it's a lot. Correct it. Hey. Let's, um, yeah. I got to get my <clears throat> I got one for you. together. Also, really quickly, you all need to know that she works out a ton, but she is also the softest woman I've ever touched in my life. She pets me a lot. Oh my god. It's, it's really like weird. Butter. In the middle of scenes when we're not supposed to touch each other, she pets me. And I'm like, that's not in the script. Why are you touch me like that? That makes no sense. Yeah, so she worry. pets. I gotta get it. Yeah. Could be worse. Get okay. Okay, what was your audition line? And I'm gonna add to that. Okay. That changed my life and brought you over here. Oh my god. Okay, so my audition, I sent in a tape. The story is actually really funny. So I put myself on tape before Christmas break okay. and sent it out. And with putting yourself on tape, it's like you never know. You never know. And you have to it just, goes into the abyss. Yeah, so you yeah. have to just kind of let it go. So I put myself on tape uh, in LA. Then I went with my boyfriend at the time to New York, spent the holidays, didn't hear anything. So I just assumed like, okay, well, I obviously didn't get it. And then normally when you book something, there's a callback process. Right, 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 right. There's a, so uh, New Year's happens. I come back to LA. I get a call from my manager and my agent. And they're like, so um, you booked it. Um, you fly out tomorrow and pack for four months. That is so Chicago. I was that like, is so in Chicago. When Chicago happened for everyone like that. One day you were living in one city, the other day you were Chicagoan. Yeah. And, and, and like immersed in this, this world, this family, this, it's just. In your first um, uh, episode, we had a scene together. Yes, we remember did. That Molly's scene? Molly's, yes. And I yes. remember it was you, me, and Kara. Yeah. And it was that moment where like, you're joining us? And Kara and I were like. I'll stay uh, with us. Out it. Stay we with need to do the rest of the interview like this. Okay, great. Um. Okay. Which co-star makes you break character during a scene most? I David. David Eichenberg? Ike, Ike, Ike's a problem for me. Because Ike has has these quirks, like, and and I have to say that I loved him in Sex in the City. Yes. Like, not liked him, loved, loved. him. Yes. It was just inappropriate how much I loved him. Yeah. And Jason Begay. Jason's voice is like this thing to me. It <laughs> pulses inside of me over here. Like, I hear Jason and I go, <gasps> you know, like that. <sighs> so Jason will, will shake me a little bit. He'll shake you. The first time I met no, him, no, I told no, him. No, 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 no. This is not comfortable. My hip hurts. Listen, this is how it is going to be. I okay. don't get to be with you that often. This okay? hip, if it was the other side, it'd be cool. This hip hurts. All right, like, all right, okay, all, okay. Right, all right. Just one, switch just one leg. Just one leg. Like this. We can, we can switch, switch sides. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. There we go. And then. There you go. This is better. Great. Yes. So, um, Jason. The first time I met Jason, I actually told him, I'm in love with your voice. I have a recording of your voice. He looked at me and he went, I went, that's probably not the best introduction. Right, right. Yeah. I agree. <laughs> okay, let me go to the next one. Okay. 
Um, if you could play another character, who would it be and why? Uh... Wow, that's a big noise. Wow. And we're out? That was... <laughs> that was... <laughs> I'm trying to think. There's a, there's a, 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 a gif for this. There has to be. Who would, I, who would I be? I answered this question. How about I name three characters? Great. And then yes. you go, oh, I can see myself like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, our relationship is very similar to the relationship I have with DeVito. Yes. yes. DeVito is a lot of fun to work with. Yes, but and I, I could want to work with her. I don't want to play her with, character because then she's gone. No, no, I mean, you can't be her. Yeah, I can see what you're saying. But I could see, you know, Gelfist. No, you would probably, like, whack out Gelfist, too. Who would I want to be? Hold on. Um, you know, I can see you with a gun. Yeah, I was going to say Voight. I feel like... I might want to be void to throw people around and push them up against walls and smack them around and get away with it. Not that I've thought about it. So, um, do you have a favorite or most impactful scene that you've done to date? I do. You know, I did this episode in season two where I played the sister to uh, a brother who transitioned. Oh! And that was a big scene for me because I was asking myself, you know, what does an experience like that really feel like, yes. you know? And I remember that when I was working, asking, I just wanted to be integrous because you understand the person who's transitioning a little bit more, but the full, whole family's transitioning too. Absolutely. And, and my character's problem was that she had problems letting go of her brother. Yeah. And and the love she had for her brother. Yeah. And I had this moment in the scene where I just kept yelling, I just miss my brother! I miss my brother! And that just, it hit me deep inside, you know? Yeah. Just, you just have to mourn that situation that you gotta say goodbye and really embrace the other person's choice. It's also a really beautiful story to be able yeah. to tell because it's like, I think the the emphasis in society, which is so important, right. is to celebrate the new birth, right. the new birth of the of the person finally right. expressing who it is that they feel that they've been. But at the same time, yeah, there is a there is a loss that yeah. happens, and to be able to really um, honor that. And if I remember correctly, there was so many like. We had conversation because the girl that I played with is actually someone who did transition. Mm -hmm. So she had so much insight and I had questions for her. Yes. So it was something it was something that was really deep for me to to try and figure out. Mm. I feel like we yeah. should end it on that note. Just that's yeah. so gorgeous. And I agree. Like yeah. really important. It was good. And impactful. It was good. So this is Marlene Barrett and Miranda. And Miranda Ray Mayo all day. We's out. Uh, wow. out.